Don Schonsenbach here, and today I'm thinking about socialized health care. And you know, I'll tell you right from the start, I think that socialized health care is unbiblical, and it's something that we should not be involved in, in trying to push forward as a Christian community. The, uh, the Bible says, talking about G Jesus talking about himself, in Matthew chapter 28, he says, All authority is given unto me in heaven and on earth. And so it's from that, that piece of knowledge, what Jesus gave us, that we can understand that authority is not something we get to take for ourselves and distribute as we please. Authority is something that comes from God and that he distributes to whom he will please. So in the case of health care, we can look through the Bible and we can find that individuals provide health care. Um, church elders are to pray for those who are sick. We find that apostles and prophets healed people and, and worked towards the health of the people. But you know, the, really the story that kind of sums up the, the best um, of how health care is provided is the story of the Good Samaritan. And in that story, that man who needed so much health care was provided for by an individual. It was that individual's money. It was the Good Samaritan's money. It was the Good Samaritan's time, the Good Samaritan's care that helped that uh, very wounded man. And so what we want to understand is that health care that is provided by the government is clearly unbiblical. There is no authority for the government to do that. Jesus has not given authority to do that work to the central government. So if we want better health care, the best thing we can do is to do it God's way.